Before I get started, I would like to say to Donald Trump, This is what a rally looks like. The number one objective of the Democratic Party in this year is to beat Donald Trump. On the one hand, we have one candidate, sometimes she beats Donald Trump in the polls, sometimes she gets beat by him, or Cruz, or Rubio. And then we have another candidate named Bernie Sanders. And every time, in every poll, he beats Cruz, he beats Rubio, and he beats Trump. Now, you can quibble about whether he beat Trump by six points or 18 points, as he did recently. But when Bernie Sanders wins this primary, we will be clear that we have a candidate that will beat whatever they send towards us. Mr. Trump, you don't have to divide our country with false fear. No, there is something more powerful than fear and hatred and violence. It is love and unity. For too long, they have tried to split us up every way they can, but we are coming together. Black and white, red and brown, Asian, working people of all colors to say, enough is enough. We want our country back. If the corporations have bought you, we don't want you. And Bernie Sanders is a candidate who cannot be bought. Now, let me close on this thought. You know, in the past eight years, I've gotten used to having an organizer who cut their teeth in Chicago in the White House. And I was up there today in Chicago, meeting with Reverend Jackson and Bernie Sanders, and I was reminded that Bernie Sanders is an organizer who cut his teeth in Chicago. So ladies and gentlemen, I say, why don't we send one more organizer who cut his teeth in Chicago back to the White House? Now, let me be very clear as an organizer, I would be remiss if I didn't point out to you that this state, this week, that Missouri this week is looking a lot like Michigan last week. When turnout goes up, we win. When you leave here tonight, do not rest until you've knocked on every door you can knock on, until you have made every call you can make. We turn out the vote in Missouri. We will win, and we will be on our way to the White House. Thank you, and God bless.